and adjust the zoom a little bit. I apologize. Perfect. It's a little too bright in here, though. We're going to turn the lights off. <sighs> That's better. Okay. We're going to start with Uncharted 1. One of my favorite games. Subtitles on. I don't need hints. Um, tutorials. Sure, why not? No photo mode. No, you know what? Oh. Eight seconds left. This is one of my feel-good games. I love this game. Play it all the time. Talking to Discord earlier about how this is what I consider a... This is like a mental health game for me. If I ever feel anxious or depressed, I love this game. I love playing it. It just makes me feel good. Now this game doesn't quite have, you know, as much going for it as some of the later Uncharted games, but it's still great. I am here off the coast of Panama where we just recovered what we believe to be the coffin of legendary explorer Sir Francis Drake, who was buried at sea over 400 Slide years ago. Over and back a little bit. <laughs> it's perfect. Are you sure you want to be defiling your ancestors' remains like that? Oh yeah. Make it sounds so dirty. <laughs> Besides. Thought you didn't believe me. Well, I did do my research, and apparently Francis Drake didn't have any children. Well, history can't be wrong, you know. For example, you can't defile an empty coffin. What the hell? It's still amazing how well this game holds up and how decent it looks today. But then when you see the evolution from <laughs> one to devil. four what is it? to Lost Legacy, on, hold it up. Hello, it's just no, incredible. No, no Deal was for a coffin. That's it. Wait a minute. If my show hadn't have funded this expedition, hey, hey, you wouldn't you have... got your story, lady. Look, Mr. Drake, you signed a contract. <laughs> I have a right Mr. to see every single thing that... Could you hold that thought? Sully, uh, we got some trouble. Hurry it up. Okay, okay. What's going on? Uh, pirates. Pirates? Yeah, the modern kind. They don't take prisoners. At least not male prisoners. Wait, what are you talking about? Nope, here they come. Uh, sh shouldn't we call the authorities or something? Uh, that'd be a great idea, but we don't exactly have a permit to be here. What? Yeah, so unless you want to end up in a Panamanian jail, we should probably handle this Oh, ourselves. that's funny. Because they're in a Panamanian jail. haven't been in a Panamanian jail. Do you know how to use one in of these? In four. Uh, yeah, I never it's caught like that before. You just you point and shoot, right? Good girl. Here we go. I never caught that. That's really cool. How the hell they find us out here? Uh, these guys have been telling me for weeks. Oh, come on. Really? Sorry about that, guys. Thought I lost him. What'd you do to piss him off? Uh, it's 
Kind of a long story. I always forget how to reload in this game. Less talking, more shooting. Nice. Hurry up, Sully. Coming around this way. Okay. Oh, they're jumping overboard. That's where the game teaches you how to melee. Oh, no, you don't. Give me that ammo. Oh, more coming aboard. All right. I just passed somebody on my friends list when it comes to enemies defeated. That's pretty cool. Oh, there's gonna be a little... Stealth kill. That's where you can't really. Rocket launcher. Okay, that's not good. What's that? Here comes Sully. Oh, I don't think I'm getting my security deposit back. Cavalry's here. Oh, thank God. Gotta get the camera, dude. Go. I can't leave without that. Still funny to me how this these sort of graphics were mind blowing when this game first came out. <laughs> I can't leave you alone for a minute, can I? I had everything under control until they blew up the boat. <laughs> yeah. You all right? Nothing the years of therapy won't fix. Well, if it isn't the beautiful and talented Elena Fisher. Flattery will get you screen time. Yeah, I'm more of a behind the scenes kind of guy. Victor Sullivan. Huh. <laughs> ah, for Christ's sake. <laughs> <sighs> uh, gotta clean these off. I can't see shit. What do you say we get out of here before we attract any more attention? <laughs> That's better. Well? A little present from Sir Francis. Ho oh, ho, so you found the carbon. Wait a minute, is this what I think it is? <laughs> Drake's yeah, man. lost diary. He faked his death. I'm trying just to like think. I, said, Sully. He must I really like this big. game. Yeah, well, let's just But each game has, us. like, a really cool aspect Thanks to it. Thanks for the loan, Mr. Drake. I think I've earned a look at that diary when we land. Oh, what up? So look, Travis in the house. Into the Pacific. He took the Spanish fleet completely by surprise. He captured their ships. He took all their maps, their letters, their journals. Jesus, just so... recorded everything. Everything about this game is just uh -huh. fun. So this... when he now this one does tend to drag a little at the end, but all of his charts and log books, everything else one. but the final fight is side. really yeah. so this... decent. He Drake discovered something on that voyage summit. Something so secret, it's just amazing so how well this game couldn't risk it getting out. came right, out Nate, and then how minute, really much they were able to improve it chase, would you? <sighs> for number two. Man only interested in the climax. He must be a real hit with the ladies. Never had any complaints. Okay, then. I'll jump to the good part, just for you. That is odd. <laughs> right, Travis, let me... Hell God damn Maybe I can do it on the phone. He was onto something big, all right. Does it say anything else? Oh, so now you're interested, huh? Yeah. Well, unfortunately, no. Last page was torn out. 
I'm telling you, silly. <sighs> Guys, just checking the Twitch. This is finally it. Yeah. Dashboard. See Only. if we can update the. We got one little problem. Yes, that's what I said. It blew up. No. It sank. This is where they just bail no, on her. That's why we have That's rude. Right? Oh. Oh no, the camera. Okay. No, Log the in. Fine. Don't worry about the camera. No. Still as good as new. Sully, the girl can hold her own. You should have seen her. Fine. You go on out there and you tell her we just found the lost city of gold. Maybe her producer can get it on the air tonight. Oh come on, huh. Nate. Travis, you the man. More or less. Oh damn. Good. Because we're gonna have every two. Travis, we just got snow world. earlier this week. This treasure, it sucked. Cut her loose right now. You're a real gentleman, Sully. I know. It stinks. She'll get over it. No, I don't. I don't care for over budget. I mean, do you realize that this could be like the biggest story of the year? <laughs> Hi. No, I don't trust him. Okay. That's why we need to move fast. So just get me the camera crew. All right, Travis. I think I did it. Should have seen that one coming. Ugh. All right. <clears throat> oh, hold on. Hold on, kid. I'm not as young as I used to be. <laughs> yeah, you weren't too old for that little barmaid in Lima, were you? <laughs> well, that was different. Although I must admit. Equally as strenuous. <laughs> well, yeah. hang in there, old timer. We're just about there. <laughs> you know, this reminds me. I ever tell you about the time I pawned a phony 16th century Santo off on Pablo Escobar? <laughs> ah, risky move, but. The way Drake moves is just so cool, because he just. Hey, are you ever listening to me? Nope. Hanging on every word. That's so cool. You really think Francis Drake came all the way up here, huh? We're an awful long way from England. Well, this game's, every Uncharted game has an incredible okay. amount of According to green. This, we're in detail. Maybe you're not reading that thing right. Let me see it. No, this is the place. So graphically impressive. There's nothing here, Nate. What a goddamn dead end. Easy, Sully. Just relax. Let's take a look around. I remember when I bought this game, man. I was so excited. And I must have played it for... Man. This is like five or six hours in, in one sitting on my first playthrough because I just was so enthralled. Well, no. uh, like it. Um... What do you think this is, Incan? Nah, it's older than that. Like two thousand years older. There we go. Oh. Over here. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna jump over this way. <laughs> Now, one only thing about Nate that Find drives me nuts is just that he jumps. He makes these incredible jumps that would just not be possible by anybody Careful else, by any stretch of the imagination. Hey, there's something funny about the ground down there. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. It's hollow. We gotta find a way to smash through this. Okay. Now I gotta push this bad boy down, crack the ground open. Good work, kid. Come on in, Sully. Uh, 
flashlights for this one. Oh, oh, oh! Ew, bad. Gross. I enjoy this game a, warm and homey a lot. Place, huh? <laughs> well, not quite what you were expecting, huh? Yeah. Where's all the damn gold? Yeah, this place was picked clean centuries ago. No good limey pirate. No, it wasn't Drake. Check this out. Looks like the Spanish got here before he did. What the hell, Sully? Nate, I'm not looking for a lousy piece of tin. I'm up to my eyeballs in debt. I was really counting on this one. Too many big bar tabs in Lima, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> that and, well, just a few bad deals. Yeah, well, I always told you to stay away from the bad guys and the bad girls. Yeah? Look who's talking. What's that supposed to mean? That reporter? I saw the way you were eyeing her. Elena? Please. I snuffed any chance with her the second we ditched her on that dock. <laughs> All's fair in love and war, kid. Uh, and what if you can't tell the difference? Then, my friend, you are in big trouble. God, I just love this game. The dialogue. The Spaniards sure left a lot it's of crap. Just so fun. Careful, Nate. That's quite a drop. Yeah, sure. I'm just gonna. I'm not kidding. Walk up here. No big deal. Sully, I'm gonna open this up for you. Here, let me do that. Go ahead. Go ahead, boy. Boy. Read it. That's a little bit like The Last of Us here, too. All right, let go. This ought to hold it. Hurry, Sully! Yeah, hurry. It's just going to explode, and I'm just going to stand here while it does it. That was a little too close. Let's hope this place has a back door, huh? You know, this looks familiar. I think there's something in Drake's journal about this. How do you open the journal? Oh, man. How do I open the journal? That's the only bad. There we go. Yeah, here it is. Looks like this thing is some kind of lamp or brazier. See if you can light it. So, after all your bitching about the cigar, now it comes in handy, huh? When you go back and play this, you do, you kind of see the little awkward transitions that don't quite hold up to Naughty Dog standards today, but these guys were still doing some really good work back then. That's how you gotta shoot it now. We gotta figure a way to clear this debris. Nice. <laughs> now what? Now we go down. Alright, not that way. Other side. Okay, wrong way. <laughs> Whoops. I was the right the first time. Uh, Nate. I might have been able to do that 30 years ago. Oh wow, that was a bad jump. Nate, don't go for the jump if you can't make it, bro. I don't know what my um, Apple ID is because it has I feel we should be able to get it. I know, but I had it the wrong way. All right. Well, give me a second, because I have to figure out what your password is. I think I wrote it down somewhere. I'll be up in a minute. Hold on. <laughs> Whoa. 
Oh my god, they're all falling. Alright, now we made it. I'm just gonna slide down this conveniently priced branch. Yeah, where's the... Where's the hidden ladder? Other side, I guess. There it is. There, Sully, I just blew up the whole place for you. Sorry, guys. Give me a second here. Alright. Well, my kids are just gonna have to wait until I figure out what her password is. Ugh. Go ahead, Sully, light it up. <laughs> you know what I really like about this game, too, is it is paced fairly well. And you, you do this whole part here without, you know, really having to... There's no fighting except for that very initial part. Which just, you know, it's a cool... Oh, Wait, I recognize down. these symbols. Right. The order of these signs has some importance. One... One is the cross thingy, two is the guy, three is the spider, four is the evil face. So one is the cross. Hey, something's happening. Alright, two is the guy, so we gotta go back over. And then three is the ugly spider thing, and then four is the nasty face. One more. We'll just jump down and go across. Looks like there's a ladder cut into the side. Oh my god, no! no! <laughs> Just jump into the water and die. God. Drake. Fuck. Ah. Whoops. I wasn't expecting to die from that. Alright, let's try this one more time. Drake! Sorry. Drake, grab the ladder and go down the ladder. There we go. As you can see here.
Like I said, quirks. Before they really had everything kind of mastered. There we go. Travis, you demand. All right. Right, now you can jump into it. Oh, don't tell me you're gonna swim it. I've been in worse. <sighs> I'm really wet. Doesn't. All right, come on. Now we gotta get Sully through to the other side here. I made it! I'm on the other side! Can you get this open? Sure can. Don't tell him to watch out or anything. Just blow up the wall. Nice one! And then here we go. Still nothing. I've got this one. And this part here is just like this looks safe. Yeah, no. Ain't no way I would ever do anything like this. Oh god. Here we go. Now we do the little Indiana Jones run towards the screen dealio, and I died. Oh no, 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 quick, Ah! Oh. I took a weird jump there. Let's try this again. This looks safe. Alright, jump straight. Don't go to the side this time, there we go. Jump. I made it. I'm okay. And Sully just trots on over. Let's go. Now it looks like we're getting somewhere. After that, we better be. You'd think that, but you're not. Yeah, Travis, I've made a bunch of stupid deaths. Must have been built around this. Around what? A statue. El Dorado. A gold statue. A huge gold statue. And look here. These people, they're worshipping the damn thing. At least I think they're people. You think? Of course. They're not. El Dorado. The golden man. Sully, it wasn't a city of gold. It was this. It was a golden idol. Man, can you imagine what that thing would be worth now? Look over here. Tracks. I bet the Spanish dragged it out on cut logs. Probably. We're 400 years late for this party. So the trail's cold. Yeah, it looks that way. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Unless... Unless what? We follow the tracks. Well, yeah. Oh, hey, David, this is really just the very beginning. Um, the only thing you missed was we uh, they uncover Drake's coffin from the bottom of the ocean. And when they pull it out, they find a journal. Then they take that journal and it leads them here. I don't know what this part of the game is called, honestly. I don't know where exactly they are right now, but they were in search of a statue of made of gold. Huh. They stop here. Yeah, it looks like and that's it. So you really, you've missed about 15 minutes. Spaniards must have made themselves a shortcut to get the treasure out. Swell. 
Now what? This is where it really starts to get good. The beginning of this game is a little slow, David. Just because the game's trying to establish a whole bunch of stuff. But, you know, you got Drake, you got Sully, and you got Elena. She's the... She's the reporter. And they're kind of establishing why they're on this. Oh, David, I love that game, man. How far in are you? There's something you don't see every day. My God. You're playing the first one, right? Uh, David, that's exactly it, man. Indiana Jones. Modern day. Um, if you've never actually played these, Dave, you're going to like this. Oh, dude, David, that's a great pick, man. I loved the first one. I got about halfway through Last Light. Nice. Dude, it gets so good after that. I don't remember much about the story, but there was a couple parts. Um, it really is. When Every time you're underground, but there's this part where you're above ground and you're going into, like, a library... Wait, 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 no wait. spoilers, but I'll tell I you, that part, story, you? that was hard for me to get through. Okay. I really Let's want to play back. Exodus. This the hard way. It looks good. It looks really good. I never actually finished Last Light, but I enjoyed the hell out of Last Light. This isn't right. I do this every time. Every time. That's not what you're supposed to do. At least, I think. You're supposed to jump in the water and go around to the back of the boat. There we go. Looks like you're gonna have to monkey across those cliffs to get into the U-boat. Yeah, it it is. It's it's a cool game because it's a shooter, but it's got some survival elements to it. I think is a good way. You know, you got some ammo conservation. You can't just go guns blazing in every um, scenario. And I think that yes, exactly. And the thing about the Redux is that they they implemented the last light controls into 2033, which. I think makes the game a little bit better overall because there's better stealth mechanics, uh, better, like, gear and stuff along those lines. Look at that jump. That was a great jump. Up, oh, up. Oh, mm, let's go over this way. I think there's a treasure. Do I need the treasure? No. But I'm going to grab as many as I can, as many as I see. Well, yeah, it, well, that's the thing, is that first initial Metro 2033 came out, and it was okay. It was good. It was a little rough. And then they released Last hey, Light, and there. that was a huge improvement. And then that's when they did the Redux. They then took everything they learned from Last Light and put it back into 2033, which is how I would like to see, say, like a Mass Effect... Uh, Remaster. If they were to ever remaster or remake Mass Effect, I would want them to take everything they put into 2 and 3 and put it back into the original game, because that would just be excellent. Nate, you should be able to drop right down into the U-boat from there. Yep. Look at that. Look at that. That looks awesome. And we're gonna go right up in here. Oh, that's funny. Okay. I'm in. What do you see? Yeah. You know, EA is weird when it comes to Blood remasters. Everywhere. They've said over and over again what? that they're not interested, which I think is a mistake. 
they're not they've got a lot of stuff they could touch like the Mass Effect trilogy, the Dead Space trilogy. I think they they'd earn, garner a lot of good faith if they were to do those games. Yeah, I could you imagine seeing Mass Effect the trilogy with the anthem like cuz the graphics are good in that. Take those graphics, take the controls from Mass Effect 2 and 3, put them all together in a single package. I think you'd I think you'd do very well with that, honestly. That's a big dream for me. That will be excellent. This, my decomposing friend. <laughs> it's weird. Every time there's a cutscene, um, camera gets a little skippy. I think the trail just got warm again. How so? Well, I just met a guy with pockets full of Spanish gold. Only the coins are stamped with a mint mark I've never seen before. You're kidding me. Looks like our German friends had a little secret. I plan on playing through all of these in order, probably a little bit every weekend. So if you guys want to stick around and see, we're going to go through one through four and then Last Legacy. And then we'll upload all of the VODs to YouTube so that you guys can catch them in order. I think that'll be really cool. David, I, you, you've got me wanting to play Metro, though. I'm going to have to dig out my copy of the uh, Redux. Uzi. We might be we might be streaming that tomorrow night. We'll see. Those games are interesting, too, because they have a morality system that isn't, like, in your face, but it does affect how people perceive you and the ending that you get and I think quarters. they've revamped it a little bit in the Still new here. one compared to the first one but the first one was very vague yeah, it looks like he was killed ripped to shreds actually Oof, still good though to go. yeah, sounds terrible Check his wallet you're all hearts Sully yeah <laughs> David you have said that man oh I love survival horror and I you know what? Here's my my suggestion is if it's that if you feel like it's tough, just put it on easy and hit the story. Yeah, there is, and I didn't even notice it until about halfway through. I think I gave like a a toy or a, a figure or a bullet or something to a kid. He says that he wants something and you just happen to have it on your person and you give it to him and then all of a sudden the screen flashes blue and that's supposed to be like a positive Thing. And every time you do it's something like bad, the screen flashes right red, I believe. Treasure. It's I very subtle, but right at the end it. of the game, they kind of tally up all that, and then you get a good or bad ending, depending on what you've done throughout the whole story. Or what? Sully? You there? Sullivan? <sighs> this is where the game starts to get real cool. If I have time, we're going to play up through the castle part here. Oh. Hmm. I wonder if you change that to the other one, if the game would feel easy. That's probably bad. I don't remember what I picked when I started to replay it, in all honesty. Sully? I'm Gabriel Roman. Yeah, I know who you are, asshole. 
I love the dialogue in this game. So Dave, that's Nate, obviously. You got Sully. He's Nate's mentor. He's in every game. He plays a big role in every game. They do a always great dialogue between them. That's not a bad idea. Take it easy, Navarro. <laughs> so, I'm afraid the time is up. This is where the Unless, of course, that you torpedo is going to go there, off. Mr. Drake, that might yeah, I hear you. That's not a bad idea. He's screwing with the innate. They heard everything. Just give him the map. Slowly. What does a Greek's marine map have to do with Eldorado? Ah, uh, in this game, you think this is a that guy, Roman, he's just... The same that map has to do he with. has beef with Sully, so, and so he Mr. followed Man, him here. For now. But just in case you need a reminder... Hey, come you, on, leave him out of it. Yeah, don't you guys usually just cut off a finger or something? That's far too vulgar. No, I think this will hurt him a bit more. Now, whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, Roman. He's got nothing to do with that. Sully! Sully! What? It's like the first 30 minutes of the game and they kill the other guy? <laughs> oh, I know. Spoilers. Although I will say, the first time I played this, it's one of those things where you just like, Ow, why are you shooting me? Stop it! Oh, really? What the hell? Like, I didn't even get around the corner. Get out of the way. Get out of my way. Alright, run, run, run. She's gonna get walped. Whoa there, cowboy. Ow. That's for leaving me at the dock. Here. Yes, David. Naughty Dog's no first PS3 off. game. And they, of course, they just don't notice those two people standing right there. Yeah, they, um, you know, obviously Jack and Daxter are on the PS2. They wanted to do a new series for the PS3. And they thought, like, you know, Indiana Jones. Amy Hennig was the writer, creative director on this game. So... She did a great job, I gotta say, because I love this game, but she's... Alright, this is where we have to... Drake, look out. Shit! Get on the other side! I'm not expecting them to just come barreling out here. Shot at. True that. Shooting at you too, you know. I love this. And here they come. I missed the first shot. <laughs> the only thing about this one is definitely the shooting is just a little wobbly. But I... you, you, you deal. Like... It's still, the cover system is good. Probably the next. Stay close. There they are. <sighs> David, you know, and the, the the amazing thing is, like, you see the the jump from this game to the second game. 
is Long just story. incredible. Tell you later. But there's a couple standout parts in this game that really just do it for me. Kind of making your way back through this whole part that you were just at. Never a dull moment, huh? Just keep your head down. These guys aren't messing I'm pretty around. Sure there's no more no people here. We're just going up the ladder. Hey, it's a, interesting. You can't jump up the ladder in this game. I guess that was a Uncharted 2 quality of life improvement. Come on, buddy. Headshot. Here we go. Oh, oh bad God, jump. No. I was so bad. Why'd I do that? Ah, oh, feels bad. Watch out, Elena. Yeah, it does. And it's definitely better on this, I think, on the remake than it was on the original game, but it's still... Come on, stay with me. Get that guy? Hard to tell. Drake is just a mass murderer. Over here, I think. Yeah. There's your car. You always been this popular? Well, I do seem to attract the scum of the earth. <laughs> uh, yeah, no offense. None taken. Do you have a good memory? Yeah, why? UK two six four two. You got that? Yeah, what is it? It's Creek's Marine coordinates. I think I know where the Spanish took El Dorado. El Dorado? The problem is, some of the bastards oh, killed thanks, Sully, Baron. damn it. If the Spanish found the treasure, they had to move it there, to that island. And Drake followed them. Well, what are we waiting for? Yeah, right. For? I'll get the That's story, always been the, the, get... the, Whatever it is you're the criticism of the Uncharted games. Is... Come on. Hey, this isn't going to be a vacation, you know. Drake is just so happy-go-lucky as myself. he's just murdered like a thousand Besides, people. Besides, you owe me one. I suppose I do. Lost treasure of El Dorado, and it's brought us here to this tiny island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Yeah, this is my. Let's get a closer. I love this part. I hope we're the first ones here. Nope. Will we discover the ruins of a forgotten colony and a fortune in Spanish gold, or does the island have darker secrets in store for us? That should keep him from changing the channel. What the hell was that? An anti-aircraft fire? This is so not cool! Oh, oh shit. We're on fire! Enough with the damn camera! We gotta bail out! Bail out? Does this thing even have parachutes? Now would be a good time to look! <laughs> yeah! I hope these things still work! We'll find out in a second. Have you ever done this before? Of course. You just jump, count to 
revive and pull the cord. Now go! Are you coming? Kind of busy right now. Get going! See you on the ground? That's right. Jump! I would have had my finger on that cord before I jumped. I yeah, so David, we um, we made it out of the ruins, got in the jeep, she takes okay. us to Scully's plane, and then as they're, they're flying to the coordinates, they get shot out of the air. This game moves quick, man. It's like set piece after set piece. So we just escaped from the temple, now we're on a plane, now we're on a new island with a new... A new objective. You didn't miss anything, really. I mean, literally. You... Oh, 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 shit. All right, so now, now we have to find Elena. It's probably a good place to start looking. Strangers trying to kill me, leave my map on a burning plane. Plane is missing, most likely dead. That's great. It's a great start, Nate. Well, that's the thing. So this is, there's a lot here. There's this big cathedral that we're gonna find. It's great. I love it. This is one. This I love this part. So now we're on a new new island, more jungle, more stuff to explore. Um, God, I'm not positive where this first game takes place, but I guess, yeah. Now I can tell you where every location is in the second and third and fourth games, but Honestly, this game, I'm not 100% positive where it takes place. Now, the one thing about this game that's a little bit different is that you're not as much globetrotting as you are in the other games. You know, I think this game pretty much takes place all on this island from here on out. Like, you're not going to new locales in different areas. Whereas with 2 and 3, you are literally everywhere. 4 has a lot of distinct areas and then Lost Legacy takes you back to this sort of deal where you're in one spot kind of through the game but regardless they do a great job come. yeah David you, if you look it up it probably is like South America or something Caribbean not Caribbean but like In the Amazon, okay, that makes sense. But we're, this is like an island, though, in the middle of the ocean. Yes, El Dorado. And we've actually found it, technically. Well, we found the remnants of it, now we're looking for... Oh, yo, bro! Well, that was right in the face. Got some nades. He's over here. Oh man. Okay, cool. So the first the first part is the Amazon. That makes sense. Okay. How's that feel? And then you get to this island and then everything takes place on on the remainder of the game is on this island, which like I said is different from the other games thanks man uh in two you're in i think it's like bolivia or colombia or something along those lines and then you there's a 
there's a Turkish museum in the beginning of the game, and and then you you go to Nepal. And then you just go through like the whole thing, which is just incredible. You're in like the city, and then you're you're in like the Himalayas. It's so great, it's so good. And then three has this awesome scene where you're in France, which is just incredible. What's that? Okay, well, she's not going to, so just go upstairs and fight. Or you can sit down here and watch. <laughs> okay, well, she's not going to fight, okay? Let it go. Oh, shit. Yes, David, we're marking our way towards that smoke. Okay. Right. Oh shit! <laughs> jump, jump, get bastard! I see you. Bastard! Nice jump, bro. Oh, the shotgun guys, for some reason, have like an insane amount of health. Alright, I need some ammo. That guy up there, man, he is just... There we go. Let's stock up. Now I distinctly remember it was a more ammo. Nice. Oh, it's a shotgun. I don't want the shotgun. Yeah. So go up here, go over this way. Shit! Jump! Treasure. Is there treasure back here? I thought. Who was shooting? Oh, I missed. Forgot to jump. Where are you? Interesting. There's another guy right here. Gotcha. See, this is where this game gets a little ridiculous. Alright, there we go. Gotcha. I'm kill beating all my friends' stats. Kind of cool. Okay. 
shotgun guy. Alright, there's one guy left. Over here. <laughs> Drop kick! That's definitely not the last guy, because the music is still going crazy. Oh, okay. Nah, no shotgun. Okay. All right, guys, I'll be right back.
<sighs> I'm back. Apologize for the wait. My kids uh were fighting. Fighting. Whatever. But nothing that they, they couldn't obviously take care of themselves, so somebody slammed somebody else's finger in a door and there was crying and Oh come on! Gotcha. He's over here. Pirates! What'd you call me? You already dead. Oh, I like how they actually reload. That's cool. I don't think I ever noticed that before. It's amazing, you play a game... I played this game for de decades. You know, like, this game first came out... I think I was like 21 or 22. 23? No, I was definitely not 20... I was definitely only 21 or 22. Ish. And I definitely don't ever remember... catching enemies in the middle of a reload, which is just awesome. Cheery. Oh. Oh, there's something up there. There's a treasure up there. Right? Am I seeing things? Ah, oh, whatever. I love this part. So... Whoa, that was dramatic. Okay, gotta go this way. I know this. I'm gonna jump here, and then we go under the waterfall. again. Whoa. That was a weird jump, but hey, whatever. Perfect, yeah, because, you know. This game is tense. Like, it, I, I'm pretty sure that a lot of this stuff doesn't actually do anything until you touch it or move on it or whatever, but, you know, it makes you feel like you have to go. Like, you have to get there. That's one. We're coming up to a pretty difficult part here, I believe, where you're like surrounded and you're just, there's just guys coming nonstop, kind of like from all directions and you have to kind of keep turning and readjusting, reorienting yourself. So it gets a little stressful. This is it. Oh, man. So I'm pretty sure you fight a whole bunch of guys, right, as you get up to that part of the plane. Then once you get up there, you come back down, you gotta go and fight a whole bunch of other dudes from the other end.
Can I get any closer without alerting them? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That was strange. Threw the grenade backwards. Oh boy. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. I guess this isn't as bad as I remember it. I have some dudes coming in from the back. Ow! Died! No! I'm gonna die! Holy crap, there's no way. David, that was rough, man. Oh, I think I did it. Doesn't look good. All right, sweet. Some grenades back here. play for about another maybe 30 40 minutes and then we'll be back on tomorrow We can get over to the cathedral part. That's a good place to stop. All right. So this is what I'm talking about. So you come down here, and it's as you're coming down. Oh look, there's guys in the background. That was a great shot, man. Right off the tree, bastard. Fun. Is that it? Wow, it wasn't as it wasn't nearly as bad as I remember. Either I got lucky there or What? Oh, man. Okay, so... Yeah, I forgot. Crap. That's right. I blow up the door, and I can get through. Super aggressive guy coming up here. Nice. Perfect. All right. See, it's funny. Ah! Oh! Better watch where I'm going. 
Damn, girl. See, this is the, like when you look at this, you know, it's like just nothing. It's literally just water. But when you play any of the future Uncharted, they do such a great job of kind of Hang on, Elena. filling in all that empty space. I love this part. I just something about this part of the game just really just does it for me. I love it. And go up over Oh jeez. And the really cool part about this this area is that there's just no No music. Ouch. Bastard! How the hell did you know I was over here? Okay. Wow, that sucked. For them. Not for me. Don't. Switch guns! Switch! I'm dead. That's a lot of dudes. Jesus. No! 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 I'm almost out of ammo. Did that really not get that guy? That's like right in front of him. Alright, let's go here. Here we go. Thanks, dude. Thanks for stopping by. Always great chatting. Keep it lively. I love this part. You have to be kidding. God, I just I do. I love this part. There's just something about this part that just every time I just mm. I don't know what it is. Treasure? No treasure, really? It's just an empty area. Oh, you can't be serious. Whoa! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Bro! I can't believe that. No, 
Wasn't I just out here? I just pushed the roll button a little too early. The game wasn't quite loaded or ready for me to, to go out the window. Get some momentum, because we got to go high. Dudes in this part. No, that was a good headshot. Gotcha. Gotcha. Make our way up the stairs. Oh boy. Come on, buddy. Gotcha. That was good. I always get myself into this trap. Gotcha. Whoa. It's weird. I always forget what to do with this part. I do, I always forget what to do here. There it is. There's Elena's backpack. No sign of her. It's either very good or very bad. See her again. Elena, what the hell is 
she doing? <laughs> Hello? Buka Pintu! See you later, Chip my tongue, Buka Pintu! Buka Pintu. It worked! There he is! Up there! Get on the gun! Oh boy. <sighs> yeah, baby. Got the door, Drake. God. Gotcha. Ow. Bastard. How are you gonna fall down? How you doing, buddy? This is one of my least favorite parts of the game. This place could use a good plumber. Just because there's so many guys here. Yeah. Keep moving. That's the trick of this part. Gotcha. Perfect. Alright, we did good that time. Nice prepared. I had lots of ammo. For, like, good weapons. Sweet. Right. I didn't waste the the magnum ammo. Otherwise I would have been probably more difficult. Alright, now I gotta raise the water level. Yeah. <laughs> 
I hear it. There it goes. Now we can get over this side and raise it all the way up. And here it goes. All right, let's just jump in ahead of time. Hurry this along. Come on, Drake. There we go. Alright, chapter 6 already? Okay. Now we should be getting back to... We should be meeting up with Elena, Elena soon. Where are you? Oh, oh, that's right. We're wait gonna a get... minute. What's so important about that tower? Oh! oh. Son of a bitch! Shit. Right in the face. In the face. In the face. Okay. Uh. Let's go up the stairs here. In the phase. Oh, I just passed Travis's total headshots. Eat that, Travis. <laughs> How did Travis have more headshots than me in this game? That's bullshit. I don't buy it for a second. I keyed. Uh huh. What's this? Okay. No, but we gotta do something in here, don't we? Or is this just for no? Okay. All right. So. Nobody to fight in here, right? This is just puzzle. Okay. Get out of the way! A little quick time event there. I always forget, where do I... Where am I supposed to go? I don't know why I always forget this part. I guess it's right here. Yeah. Hurry! I thought I had more time to time that jump. Okay. There we go. Why would you let me jump that way if I'm not supposed to go that way? Oh, that was bad. 
That looked painful. Sorry, Drake. God, it's a little harrowing. Straight up. Excuse me. Thank you. Keys. Oh, we're just gonna go all the way down. Okay. Big shootout here. Yep. Give me that. You. Gotcha. That's a bad throw. Come on, health. I need you. There we go. like a dude right on top of me or something. It's a good spot. Can't get in here. Not the most adventurous, but that's all right. It's all about survival, baby. Out of here. Shotgun guy, you gotta take him out first before we move on. Okay.
little minigun action here. Cool Drake is just like full on mass murderer mode right now. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Oh, that's all right. Now we're making good progress through this game. I think we will stop at this next area because that's going to make a good. It's going to make a good starting point for the next part of the stream. Hmm. These aren't Spanish. They're English. They're English. Whoa. Fletcher, we have gone to the Great Tower. I pray that you will meet us there. Ooh. Francis, Francis Drake. The time. Wow. So you made it. But what were you plotting? Oh. Ow. The hell, man. Come right through the door unannounced. Not cool, bro. Not cool. Oh, look at that. Now that, that's a view, man. Wow. Yeah, thanks. So I just wanted to this game. This is very reminiscent of Uncharted 4 with the the buildings in the distance and that must be Drake's oh. tower. Not that way. That's back down. It's one of those parts where I just don't remember exactly where to go. Right here? That looks right. <laughs> There we go. Where'd she go? Now where does where does Drake get? Snuck attack. It's gonna get ambushed somewhere. Is this hit? I think it is. I think Let's this is where we're Drake. stopping. So what were you looking for, huh? The Capitol building. Well, now, that looks familiar. Go down. Huh. The ship's never left. Elena. Hey, there she is. Watch this. Oh, oh crap. No. We got him. Ah, okay. Perfect. This is where I wanted to stop. I know I'm not a big-time treasure hunter like you, but I doubt you're gonna find El Dorado in there. How'd you get yourself in this mess? Trying to rescue you, as a matter of fact. 
Oh, that's so sweet. Traditional sandstone, brick, and stucco. Limestone mortar, huh? How'd you get to know so much about this? My show, episode four, Architects of a New World. Yep, it'll just take a tug to pull these bars out. What? No, wait, are you sure? Get out of my way, put off. Hey, Batman, open <laughs> this goddamn door. Oh, All right, crap. we're going to pause it. This is where we're going to come back next time. We're going to leave it right here, and then we'll catch you guys tomorrow. Uh, I will give you a time. Check out either on Twitter, Hopeless Pros, Instagram, Hopeless Pros, uh, Discord. If you're in the Discord, we'll announce that we're going live. Um, but I'll have a better idea of time frame tomorrow. All right, everybody, thanks for watching tonight. We'll catch you then. Take it easy.